Hello everybody, uh, how are you doing today? I'm doing uh, really great, I just came back from a super great sunny uh, day. So, um, still want to change the world, still want to make an incredible political artwork, still want to talk about art, I do. So, uh, today's video is about uh, the census. Yes, the census. The census? The census. Census. Okay, well that was just a joke for the French speaking people of this channel, I hope you appreciated it. Anyway, the census is creating a space where you can't agree or disagree. So it means it's not uh, about engagement, like saying, I'm gonna change the world. But it's neither about resignation. I'm not interested in politics. No, the dissensus is this weird space in... The dissensus is this weird thing uh, in between this weird third path. The dissensus is about thwarting the expectations of your audience. So in French, to thwart is contrecarré, which is changing how things should normally happen. I hope you appreciated this video about the dissensus. If it, oh no, that's too early, that was a dissensus. So the dissensus is a kind of disturbance of a situation. You can, for example, uh, disturb the given rules of a situation. <laughs> now I'm in the role of the viewer. You can also disturb the judgment of your viewer. This video is so boring. Yeah, it is so boring, this video. <laughs> But it's not about saying it's good or it's bad. It's not about saying a judgment, a judgment uh, towards your audience, a judgment toward the situation, a judgment towards the context. I really love YouTube. And this is a super interesting strategy, a super interesting political strategy, because it just creates a, a weird moment, a weird space, where you just uh, thwart the expectations of the audience without giving any solutions. In, in our context, uh, the dissensus is about the relationship we have when we watch a YouTube video. Watch a YouTube video. Still, according to Rancière, to be able to create a dissensus, you have to maintain a space of play, reverse perspectives, and renounce the will to emancipate. And these will be the subjects of the videos of these upcoming weeks. I hope you appreciated the video. Yeah, this is the real one, but then I have a conclusion, so keep watching. I hope you appreciated this video about the dissensus. If it's the case, please give us a like, leave a comment in the section below. And if it's not done yet, please subscribe to my channel, Grey Truth. Yes, yeah, so I did this whole video, you know, to, to question how an audience could watch something on YouTube. Of how you could watch um, a YouTube video. Mm. Because, yeah, it's the way your relation you would have when you watch this, this video. Mm -hmm. And then create a dissensus in the way he was watching this, uh, this video. So I think it's an interesting thing, um, the question of the layers. The layers, because then we add a new layer to this and it's just um, this was the layer with Casimir and then there's the layer with you and it, it adds uh, something new to yeah you like it mm -hmm. yeah because you don't know where your viewer is so to have different layers is quite interesting I think because internet is something where you don't know the context so it's not the same than that and yeah I think it's uh, it's interesting yeah.